Hi, I'm Eric Kimball. Welcome to Four Day Carrots Part 4. In this video, I'm going to go out into my garden and dig carrots. This is now seven months since the carrots were planted, as shown in Four Day Carrots Part 1. It's February, it's cold, there's a lot of snow out here, but it is still and uh, sunny, so the cold is bearable. As for the snow, I have my shovel to help me, and I have my fork to hopefully dig carrots once I've figured out where they are and uh, gotten access through the snow to them. So uh, this could prove interesting. And you can hear that crow, I think. Crows are excited about this, just like I am. Okay, here we are. I'm at the end of the rows of raspberry canes. You stand up here, pivot around. If my bearings are correct, right over here, hello, is the carrot bed. It's there. What you are looking at here is a bag of leaves. I've got my tripod set up. Hopefully this will come through clear. I put bags of leaves around the bed and I surrounded it with these bags of leaves, dry leaves. Then I filled the, uh, the bed itself with more dried leaves. And then I put this tarp over it. So I'm in the right spot. See here I have a tire sidewall and that uh, was used to hold down the plastic in the fall before snow came. There's the bag. It was not quite so flat when I put it there. Look at that. The soil is still soft. Not frozen. That means we should be getting some good carrots out of here. See these leaves are still dry. They have some insulative value for certain. There's a lovely carrot. Look at that lovely carrot. Oh, now there's one that is not a perfect specimen. Still a good carrot though. Let's see if its siblings in the tri planting look better. That one does. That one does not. Yeah, this is reality TV. Not every carrot comes out perfect. It's kind of a metaphor for life, isn't it? It's still, still a firm carrot. If it was a little cleaner, I'd take a bite. There, nice one. That's it, I got a whole long bed here. But uh, I'm not going to film the whole thing. You don't want to watch that. These carrots are looking good. Seven months later. February, that one broke. Yes, we got the ugly ones. But uh, they're all good. They're all fresh. They're all organic. They're probably quite sweet. There's one of the prize winners right there. Yep, there we go, folks. Four Day Carrots Part 4. It is entirely possible to go out into your garden in February with two to three feet of snow on the ground and dig carrots, nice carrots, right out of the ground. But uh, it's a lot of work, so that may not be the best solution. 
In fact, I think it's probably not the best solution, certainly not for me. I think a better solution is to make the leaf bag clamps, which I show in another video, those make sense to me because I can dig the carrots in the fall, put them into the leaf bag clamp, and they're not way off out in my garden. I can put them right on the edge of my garden where they're readily accessible, already dug. It'd be a very simple way without a root cellar to keep carrots, much simpler than digging them out of the garden. But it is entirely possible to dig your carrots out of the garden in the winter if you insulate them and uh, dig yourself a path through the snow. There we go. Mm -hmm.